Hello everyone. There is a river called Cholitika River over which a bridge is made called the Cholitika Bridge in Honduras in Central America. Now this river was very popular for its thunderous storms and hurricanes that it produced each year. So the natives decided to build a very strong bridge which would last over a period. So this bridge was made by the experts, the Japanese experts, and it was inaugurated in the year uh, 1998. But what happened was very amazing. The bridge that was made over this river was intact when the hurricanes arrived later that year. But the river itself changed its course and the bridge was just left intact there and the river ran, you know, making a course of its own, which was a very amazing fact of nature. Therefore, that was the bridge and the river as you saw it in the picture. So sometimes we are so engrossed in the problem and we wanted, uh, they wanted the bridge to last. But here they had to adapt to the change, similar to the situation, which nobody expected. But we need to adapt to the change, which is very difficult and which is not same for everyone. Your internet connectivity not working well is not similar to someone not being able to get a meal for the day. You not being able to go out with your friends, it's not similar to someone missing their child in a faraway land. You not being able to enjoy the daily pleasures of life, it's not similar to someone earning a very low wage per day. In the end, i just like to say this, taking the example of that bridge, where the natives thought the bridge to be the solution to the problem and the bridge was supposed to last but they had to adapt to the change similar to this situation so i just like to raise a question in your minds that do we have to adapt to the change and what are the changes that we need to adapt is it going to be same for everyone and do we have to feel grateful for what we already have?